as we show you eight crosses in honor of the eight people killed during a normal day of shopping in Allen. This morning that memorial continues to grow. And we are learning the names of all eight victims of that shooting on Saturday. We start our team coverage this morning with their stories. Suzanne Bruner live at that memorial. Hi, Suzanne. Hi, Kara. This morning, families are grieving. Communities are coming together for prayer and hope. And the more we learn about the eight victims in Saturday's shooting, the more heartbreaking this all is. The victims range from three to 37 years old. A GoFundMe shares the youngest killed is James Cho. He was with his mother, Cindy, his father, Q, and brother, William, exchanging clothes William had just gotten for his sixth birthday. William is the family's only survivor. And we just learned minutes ago, this is according to ABC News, William will be released from the hospital today. In Wiley, the school district shared the devastating news with families. Two young students at Cox Elementary, sisters, both killed. 11-year-old fourth grader Daniela Mendoza and her 8-year-old second grade sister, Sophia Mendoza. Their mother, Ilda, is critical in the ICU right now. Aishwarya Thatikanda was also one of the victims. She was shopping for her 28th birthday with a friend who's recovering in the hospital. Thatikanda was an engineer from India but lived in McKinney. Friends describe her as friendly and smart. It's a nightmare. Yeah. We wouldn't expect this in one of the largest Indian community population. And it's really shocking. It sent a shocking waves across the country, across the world. Texas DPS identified 32 year old Elio Kumano Rivas of Dallas as a victim who died. And loved ones are mourning the loss of 20 year old Christian LaCour, a Farmersville ISD grad. He was working as a security guard at the premium outlet. His mother shared on Facebook she and the family are broken and will never be whole again. Once again, according to ABC News, some new information we learned minutes ago. William Cho, the six year old boy we were telling you about, will be released from the hospital today. He is one of seven people recovering from injuries right now. Mark.